everyone, welcome back. Hope you're all doing well and having a lovely day. So it feels like so long since I sat down with you and just did a fashion haul. It literally has been a while. But recently I picked up a few pieces from ASOS and also Zara, which I'll get onto a little bit later as well. So I'm gonna open this parcel with you and try everything on. You know the drill by now. I'm working with Shop Tagger on today's video. If you haven't heard of it before, you really, really need to go and give it a go because it's been a bit of a game changer for me while shopping. It's completely free and the reason it's been a game changer is because you'll get notified when a product that you like or product that you love has either come back into stock or it's gone into the sale. It's so, so clever. It works on over 2,500 retailers' websites and it's great for websites like ASOS when you're scrolling through and you see something that you love but it's out of stock in your size. You can put it into a little list so that you know when it comes back into stock, it will notify you. And it's great as well for those more luxury retailers. Maybe there's something like a pair of shoes or a bag that you absolutely love but you just can't justify spending the full price on you can set it to notify you either when there's any price change when it goes down by 25% 50% so that if and when that happens you'll get notified straight away and then you can make a much more informed purchase you might not feel as guilty about spending the money on it and then you know you've also got it for the best price as well so all you have to do to get it is go over to shoptagger.com sign up and then you just download this little button which will appear in your browser's toolbox it's so clever then you just go shopping have a look on whatever websites you want and you can start adding products to um, a number of wish lists you could have one for yourself you could have one for your baby or your kids you could have a christmas wish list i think it's the best time of year to get shop tagger as well because of all of the christmas and january sales that are coming up you will literally be the first to know when anything that you liked before christmas it was full price goes into the sale and then you can buy it when it's cheaper. It's just one of those really handy tools that I thought you guys would be interested in hearing about because it can save you a few pennies or it can help you bag that item that went out of stock that you really, really wanted to get your hands on. Um, so I'll leave some more information about it in the description box below. But for now, let's get into the haul. So I did make a rather large ASOS purchase. I don't think I've done an ASOS haul for a while. So yeah, I got some really nice winter pieces that if they suit me, I feel like most of these items will just see me through winter. The first thing is this. Oh, okay, this is a jumper. I love me a bit of mustard. This is almost like a brown mustard, like a more of a camel colour. So I thought I'd get this because it looked really lovely and festive. It's a little sequined jumper. Yeah, I thought that was really cute. So it's got rainbow um, sequins all over it. But I like the fact that the jumper makes it that little bit more like muted. It's actually pretty small. I don't know if it's cropped or what the size of it is. So I got it in an eight. Okay, this seems really small for an eight. This one is a really lovely forest green. I always gravitate towards this color at this time of year. It's a ribbed t-shirt. Um, it's actually really thick. It's somewhere between like a thin jumper and a thick t-shirt. It's got these three buttons on the sleeves which I think just adds a nice little touch to it. Um, and as I said it's ribbed. It's just a round neck. I think is it mango? No it's Stradivarius. It's a Stradivarius in a size small and I thought this would look lovely tucked into literally anything. Skirts, jeans, um, yeah even under dungarees it would look nice I don't actually have any so I don't know why I'm saying that but I know obviously lots of people really like dungarees with jumpers and t-shirts on under this time of the year so that would be good for that then I picked up this I don't think I can get through winter without like cream fine knit jumpers there's just something about them I could put five of them in my shopping basket and then I get to check out and I'm like no you, you don't need five of them you need one of them so this one actually looks really nice um I've had a couple like this from Primark and they've been great um but this one just feels that little bit softer I really like the fact that this has a high neck it's not like a massive turtleneck like this but it's just a nice high neck which is ribbed um but then the jumper isn't ribbed it's just a very thin knit so again perfect for tucking into things this is an asos own brand and i got it in a size eight just to be a little bit more i guess slouchy um but yeah i'm sure that will come in really handy this winter oh they're my boots oh i got a bit excited about them 
I've got so many boots, it's kind of bad, but I realised that every winter, autumn winter, I just wear out my black boots because I get so much wear out of them, by the next year they're really scuffed and I just think they look quite bad, so I tend to get rid of them. So I treated myself to a new pair and I thought these were absolutely beautiful. So they have this gold detail running around them and then they also have a gold zip and a little almost tassel-like zip on them. And they're just a really nice, almost like a Chelsea boot, ankle boot. They're just really nice, sturdy. The heel's going to give me some height because I'm quite short, but they're not too high to just walk around in. They're going to be really, hopefully, going to be really comfortable. Um, got them in size 3 because I am a size 3. They feel nice and heavy, but not like they're going to weigh you down too much. I just think these are going to be absolutely perfect. And then I got this jumper, which, hmm... I don't remember it ordering this. The one I ordered had green on it. Let's have a look. Right, so I'm almost 100% sure I didn't order this. If the jumper I'm thinking of comes out, then maybe I did. But I don't remember ordering this jumper. I mean, it's really cute. It's nice. It's sort of like an oatmeal and cream stripe, like chunky stripe. Again, it feels quite short. I don't know if I've been used to wearing like longer length jumpers recently or something but it just feels short but I suppose it's your average jumper length. This is in a size extra small and it's by Only Our Story. Hmm, I'm gonna have to check my order. It's actually really pretty. It's got um in the middle as well it's got like a rose gold metallic thread running through it. It's really nice. I just don't remember ordering it which is a bit weird. I, I've obviously ordered quite a few jumpers but it is winter so you know this is a little new look one which I've been eyeing up for a while and I didn't get but I just thought it was so cute again it's quite short I don't know if it's just me like seeing things weirdly today anyway it's a grey jumper with these really cute almost felt like cream pom-poms all over it um this is quite wide as well so it's going to look fairly slouchy but would look nice again tucked into like a midi skirt which I'm going to hopefully show you in a second. So I got this in a medium because I do like slightly oversized jumpers. Um, yeah, I like that. I'll see what it looks like on, but I do like that. Next up, I did get another cream top. But I justified it because that one's a jumper, this one's a t-shirt. Um, it's cream. I like the fact that the sleeves are three quarter length because you don't always want a jumper on, especially when you're indoors and you want to just take a layer off. This is going to be perfect. It has the little buttons on the shoulder on one side, um, ribbed. Yeah, that's really nice. And I feel like I'll probably get quite a lot of wear out of that. And that's a size small. Then I got this, which is, I don't know, what is it? Please let me have ordered it at least. <laughs> uh, okay, right, yes, this is a polka dot midi skirt. I lived in a polka dot dress and a polka dot jumpsuit like cropped jumpsuit in the summer so I really just love black and white polka dots and white and black polka dots um, but anyway I got this I just have been wanting to start wearing like jumpers with a midi skirt and boots or trainers I just love that look um, maybe it's getting a bit too cold for it but if you only have a small amount of your leg on show maybe it's okay I don't know I just love that look, so I thought I would try and incorporate a little bit more into my sort of everyday fashion. This is a really lovely one, it's a soft jersey material so it hangs really nicely. I don't know if it's showing on camera, um, but it's pleated. I just love it. This is an ASOS own brand in the size 6. So yeah, that's really cute. I got this which I'm quite excited about. I thought this would go with lots of things. And again, probably didn't need another scarf, but I got one. I just loved the grid pattern on it. It's really wide and chunky. Actually, now I'm looking at it, this is Rupert's scarf. <laughs> Have I bought Rupert's scarf? Was that this colour or was it yellow? Oh my goodness. If I can find a picture, I'll put it here. I bought Rupert's scarf, haven't I? I don't know how I feel about that, but I... Putting that to one side, I really like this. It's really cosy and chunky. The bottoms are very tasseled, very long tassels. And it's by Monkey, or Monkey. I never know how you're meant to say that. Again, another brand that I always find myself 
usually purchasing something from on ASOS. Then I got another pair of shoes. These are by Raid. Um, let's have a look what they look like in the flesh. Okay. These are really cute. They're a bit smushed. They're these really lovely... Are these mules? I'm going to call them mules. Um, they're very Gucci inspired with the like saddle mouthpiece. You know, like Gucci's very like equestrian inspired, isn't it? So it's got that going on. Um, I thought these were really lovely. Maybe not that appropriate for winter, but there'll be occasions where I can wear them. And at least they do cover your toes, so your toes aren't like freezing, but I guess the rest of your feet are. But even if I don't wear them too much th through winter, I know I'll get loads of wear out of these because I've been looking for a pair like this for so long. So I'm really glad I found them and they were really inexpensive as well. So that was good. I'll link all of this below for you in the description box below if you want to go and have a look at anything after this video. I got this skirt which I believe is uh, New Lookers again. Again, one brand that I always gravitate towards on ASOS. Um, I got this in a size 4 which I'm actually quite pleased about looking at it because it looks a bit on the large side so maybe it's more true to a size 6 I don't know um, usually when they do a size 4 it generally means that they the sizes are a bit bigger I don't know but I'm hoping this is going to fit me I saw it in the store or on their website I can't remember which and I really loved it it's actually like almost a furry material it's like a, a, a felty furry material but I don't know how to describe it it sounds gross but with a little white like ribbed one of my things tucked in or a jumper and boots it will look really cute so i got that i'm quite a fan of a paper bag style waist so i picked these up they don't always suit me but i still seem to buy them so we'll see what they look like on but i was really drawn to the sort of wine burgundy color of these like plum color um and they just look really smart and sophisticated if you have a meeting or these would be great for workwear as well. Again, they're a new look. I got them in a six and I just love that waist because you can just tuck things in and it looks really put together and really nice. And they look very tailored. So I'm glad I got those. It's another new look jumper. Obviously loving the new look. New looks on Shop Tagger as well. Um, but obviously it's good to go on Acer sometimes because you can just get everything in one place and I've got like the premier delivery so it comes quickly so yeah I got this jumper which is this beautiful rose pink um it's quite a soft jumper it's a like a, a a very fine knit it feels really nice quality um I'm not sure how much it was but obviously being from New Look it wasn't very expensive this is more on the longer side of the jumpers that I've got um, but again, this is going to just look really nice over so many things. Layered under coats and with scarves. And I just love this colour. It's one of my favourites. So that was a bit of a no-brainer. Very easy piece to wear. So that's everything I got from ASOS. That took a while to get through. I just wanted to quickly show you a couple of bits that I got from Zara Girls. Now, my plan was to do a whole haul on buying clothes from the girls section in stores to see what I could find. I quickly realised it's really only Zara where this works for me because I love their younger range. It just looks so cute. It's got a couple of things. The first being this little leopard print um, like shirt dress which is so cute. It looks like this and if you had a little girl how cute would it be that you could also match um i just thought this looks really lovely i don't particularly think you would know it was from zara girls i like the little black tires that it's got going on there it's just a really cute shirt dress and i love the fact that the leopard print is very like the the beigey color is very muted i prefer that to really dark leopard print but that's just my personal preference and this was only 22.99 um i got this little dress which I love. I don't think it's going to suit me though, so I'm probably going to take it back. Um, it's this little, like, very similar actually, but it's more of a smock dress. And it has little tyres on the sides. It doesn't have a collar. It's just very, like, almost little house on the prairie. But I thought it would look really nice with this long line cardigan. And the cardigan just sits a bit weirdly where... I don't know if you can see where it sort of, it looks like it's meant to be done up and then where the buttons are, it just hasn't been finished off very well. I don't know, I'll try it on for you to see, but it just, it looks a bit, 
it doesn't look great so I might have to try and find a different sort of long length cardigan so yeah that's everything I got I feel like I got quite a lot of stuff actually I think it's going to see me through winter quite well um yeah thank you so much for watching everyone like I said at the beginning of the video go and check out shop tagger I've linked them in the description box below for you to go and find out more give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you're new for lots more videos just like this and I'll see you in another video very soon bye guys